What's up, y'all? I know this is a weird way to start a video, huh? But today, I'm gonna be doing the, I put up two things. The three reasons why your manifestations are not coming to you. And we're gonna get right into it. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I got a lot more coming for y'all. A lot, oh snap, I got a lot planned. I got a lot in the making for y'all. So I, I just, you know, I don't even know how to put this. I just really hope you guys really take this information and y'all do the the best y'all can with it. I'm not telling y'all how to live. I'm not telling y'all what to do or, or how to do whatever you're doing. I'm just here to, I'm just a messenger. I'm here to tell you three reasons why your manifestations are not coming. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and we're gonna get to it right now. No more wasting your time. The first reason your manifestation is not coming and your manifestation won't come is because, first of all, you don't even believe that these manifestations are your manifestations. Most of the time, when you have something that you want to manifest, it seems like it's so like out of reach. Like, oh my God, like you you can't do it, or like you you're not 100% with the fact that that's your manifestation in your mind, and you don't think that people are gonna get that. You don't you don't think the first thing you need to start doing is realize that everything is possible in this universe. You're here. You're <laughs> you're an anomaly in yourself. So stop thinking of all the the, the bad things and the negativity that ha that can happen and thinking of all the and think about about the positive that can happen, the positivity that can happen because just like there's negativity, there is always positivity. So if you tune into the negativity, that's going to become your dominant reality because all you're doing is tuning into the negative, the negativity. As in, like, say, I didn't want to make. I keep using this as an example because it's a good example. Say I didn't want to make these these videos because I was afraid of how people looked at me. That's me using the negativity and applying it to my everyday life. So in reality, I'm not making the videos. But if I if I'm looking at it from my perspective, I really don't give a uh, you know, I mean, I'm, not, I'm not trying to curse no more. I'm trying to cut that out, but I really don't care how people look at me. You know what I mean? I really don't care. Like, look, I got my shirt off. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I like, I really don't care. So, me using that and putting this in my reality, as in, like, oh, I don't care. So I'm gonna make the the videos anyway. In that reality, I'm tuning into the positivity, the positive of me actually doing it and I'm gonna do it anyway, regardless, so the video gets done. So I'm tuning into positivity and that becomes my dominant reality that I tune into. You get what I'm saying? So you gotta become 100% with yourself as in like, you know that this is your manifestation and you don't care how anybody else looks at you for trying to manifest what you wanna manifest. You, you know what I mean? Oh man, it's cops back there. I'm glad I don't have my, I'm hands free now guys because yeah, I don't wanna be holding the phone and recording. And this is just much easier. Tell me guys if you like this this style of recording in the car better than before. Cause I know I got the, the little steering wheel in the way, but you can still talk to me and, and hear me. You know what I mean? But thank you guys for spending time with me. We're about to get to the second one. I don't want to take up too much of your time. So we're back. The second reason why your manifestation is not coming is because you're expecting someone to give it to you, or you're expecting some, you're expecting it. And when in reality, success isn't that. Success is you, the consciousness behind it. So what do you really wanna do to be successful? What are you tuning into every day to make this a reality? What are you, are you putting in the footwork? You gotta be a foot soldier behind, you gotta, nobody's gonna support you if you don't support yourself. You gotta put that footwork in behind your own craft. You know what I mean? Because 
there's no there's there's no shortcut you gotta you gotta go through every single one of these days just like everybody else everybody else is multi-dimensional just like you just like they're they're manifesting they're unconsciously manifesting their reality and letting it unfold to them how about you become become conscious of the reality that you're creating for yourself every single day because technically you're multi-dimensional there's something that you can do every single day <clears throat> that will change your life i don't know what it is i don't know what you like doing i don't know who you are but i feel like i'm talking to somebody so if this resonates you hit hit the like button but i'm just saying all you have to do is click remember that you're in control of this don't let don't let external things control where you're going where you're going with your energy this is your energy pure energy this is you so every single day the the same amount of days is passing for you than it is for Jeff Bezos or it is for <clears throat> I can't even talk guys. Anyway, as it is for Jeff Bezos, as it is for freaking Steve Jobs, as it is I don't look guys. I don't really look at these guys. I just know that they're a human being just like me. So like I said, we're multidimensional, so every single day is a new day. Every moment is a new moment. You're constantly creating this. So try to try to think of something that's gonna step you out of that loop and give you a little bit of something. Like, you know, a, a little bit of something that's gonna push you to wanna do something. You know what I mean? You can't just go through every day unconscious because you're just gonna keep creating the same reality. Your personal, your personality. I got this from um, Aaron Dowdy. He said, "Your personality creates your personal reality." So if I, if look, bro, all you have to do is wire something into your personality. That, I mean, I don't know. You're you're multidimensional. Like I said, every day is a new day with you. I can't, I can't sit here and tell you what to do, but. The only the thing that we have in common is every single day is the same day for each of us. What are you doing in that day? Some people didn't make a video today. We're all on YouTube. That's what I mean. Like everybody's in these same days. It's just what you're doing with these days that are passing you every single day. You know what I mean? You can go out and make one fan a day. If you go out and make one fan a day, bro, like you know what I mean? And that's why I kind of post these videos. I kind of think of it like I'm a virus spread. I'm a virus spreading on the internet. I'm, I can't even fucking talk. A virus spreading on the internet. If COVID can go out here and catch six bodies today, I can go out here and catch six six views today or six subscribers or something. This guy's looking at me, but you know what I mean. Like every single day, that's a number. Think of it as zeros and ones. Today you scored, the the next day you didn't. You know what I mean? So today you made one point, yesterday you made zero points. What are you adding these points to? What are you doing with these days? These are days, these are actual days of your life that are passing, your, your, your energy. And you're, all you're doing is aging. So as you're aging, what are you doing? What is this What is this movement in between the aging? What are you doing? Like that's what, that's what I'm asking. But that's the second reason while your manifestations are not coming. We're gonna get the third one out for you right now. What's up, y'all? <laughs> the third reason you're not manifesting is because you're thinking about numbers and money instead of how many people you can help and serve. Because technically, say, say I serve one person today, that one person could give you $100. You know what I mean? And then you still got the rest of your day. So you gotta realize, we're all in our own space and time. There's no, money is just, you can go right now and rob a bank for $60,000, like you know what I mean? And then you got the money. But you gotta realize, what are you doing to get the money? It's not about the money and I don't have the money right now and I can't do this and I can't do that. You're a living, breathing being. So what you can do with this body, money is just energy. Where you gotta go get the money. What are you doing to get the money? If you don't understand how to manage your own time and realize that 
you see the sun setting right now but i'm making this video for you guys and it's gonna get out tomorrow so it's like i'm doing this today what are you doing today to get to your to get to your destination you gotta you gotta feed a whole bunch of people you gotta these are these are these are what the fuck anyway look these are your these are your people that you want you want fans you want you want front you want people to support you but you don't even you're not you're just worried about how much money you're getting if you're worried about imagine 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 your favorite celebrity right and he's like, oh, I'm not gonna post a video unless I get a thousand, a thousand, uh, a thousand views. You know what I mean? But you really want to see that video. What type of person is you? Don't you're not gonna want to support him anymore? Like you know what I mean? Like if it's all about money, then what am I even here for? Like you know what I mean? That's what I'd be feeling like. You know what I mean? I like watching YouTubers. You know what I mean? But they don't make it seem like it's all about money, even though technically, obviously, you're posting a video on YouTube, you're gonna get paid from it. Like you know what I mean? So it's like, try to try to shift your focus from how much money can I make to what can how many videos can I make or how much how many songs can I make? Because if you you can make an infinite amount of an infinite amount of songs, if you make if you make one million songs and you post one million songs, if each of them songs got one view, you just got one million plays. Like you know what I mean? Like you are infinite you being here is bro look where we're at like you don't want to keep continue doing this you don't want to continue doing being wherever you want to be whenever you want to be and not having nobody looking over your shoulder all the time do you like that so maybe instead of doing whatever you're doing in the dark which is when i see when i say what what you're doing in the dark it's like I can't see what you're doing right now. Only you can see what you're doing right now, but it's still getting done. So that's what I mean in the dark. I'm in the light right now, showing you guys, telling you guys information. This is me being in the light. This is what I'm doing in real life, in the light. What are you doing real life, in real life, in your light? Because it's dark to me. It's darkness to me because I can't see what you're doing or hear what you're doing or even perceive of what you're doing. You know what I mean? It's, so. If we all in the dark came to the light and was like, oh snap, this is what I'm really doing. I'm really contributing to destroying the planet right now. Even though it doesn't seem like it, I'm still one person out here doing it. Like, you know what I mean? If we all got on that time of, type of time, and I don't know, I'm ranting right now, but the video's over. You, you can click off the video. You didn't got your, the, um, the three reasons why the manifestation is coming. I just like to talk to my people. But... Like I said, if we could all like come to the agreement and be like, oh snap, like we're, I'm in the dark right now to this guy, but what I'm doing right now still matters because time is still passing for all of us relatively. Even, not relatively, generally speaking, it's all, pa it's passing for all of us. So which, that's like, that's like saying, oh, I'm gonna throw this trash on the ground. That trash is gonna stay on the ground forever. So it's like me, one person, that doesn't matter. Like, you know what I mean? But now there's a million people out here doing it. Now there's a million pieces of trash on, on the ground one day. Then, like, you got to realize we're relative to ourselves. So we're not really thinking. Everything else is in the dark. We're not worried about that. We're just worried about us right now. So if we're just throwing trash on the ground, then it's like, how many other people did that today? Like, you know what I mean? There's so many. Like, you know what I mean? Y'all got to think like that. How many other people ate? a chicken today like you know what i mean like we're in real life so that stuff is happening like in real life i mean i don't know if obviously we're in real life i don't know if y'all get what i'm saying but people act like this planet is going somewhere like we're we're just you gotta look at us from a bird's eye view like we're literally like like apes walking around on this planet just throwing shit around fighting having control over each other you gotta look from a bird's eye view like what are we doing like right now like we look crazy for real if, a, if an alien species came to this planet right now and was like oh what are these guys doing oh my gosh they're they're there's humanoids here let's go look at what they're doing and we're fighting talking about race and you know what i mean like if i came to a planet just by my consciousness alone 
and I, I'm on this planet with y'all. So I'm saying, just my mind consciousness alone, and I came to this planet, and I looked, and I, I'd be like, yo, what are we doing? Like, what is this paper? What is this paper money? Like, what are we doing? Like, what are we really doing? Like, honestly. But thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I don't know. I just like talking to my people. I make a, I make a new video two times a week, two to three times a week. I try to get it out. You know what I mean? But you will get a video two to three times a week. I promise you that. But like, comment, subscribe, and I'll be back for y'all. Thank y'all for going for talking to me. You know what I mean? Uh, actually contributing to me. I love you guys. See you guys later. Bye.